clearing CSIR net exam. This is a big thing. We all say it's a big thing. But today, I'm going to highlight, is it really worth it? So apart from selecting for the lectureship and junior research fellowship, candidates can avail various benefits after qualifying for the CSI net exam. Here are the listings. First point is stand out in any research interview. If you want to apply for any research work in India and have qualified for the CSI net, you will get more preferences than any other candidate. As a result, you can stand out from other candidates. It will also help you during your research work. Standing out during an interview process means you will have a higher chance to get hired by the recruiter. Second point is chance to work in top labs with the best minds. If you are passionate about research and development, a great advantage of the JRF is that you can work in the best laboratories in India, which is also under the supervision of some of the best researchers and trainers. You can become a researcher at one of the top Indian universities after passing the prestigious CSI and JRF exam. There are various jobs in a lab, such as junior research fellowship, senior research fellowship, PF, SPF, etc. Working under the guidance of experienced people allows you to improve yourself and learn new things every day. Not forgetting the salary, it ranges from 18,000 to 40,000, but he can be promoted at any time, he or she, depending on their performance. Next point is PhD with a good fellowship. After qualifying the CSI net, you can apply for the PhD program in any recognized university or institute. Apart from this, you will also get an opportunity to bag a big amount 31,000 monthly stipend for the first and second years and in 35,000 for the next three years. And not only that, you can use it during your PhD program so that you will not face any financial issues. Now you will ask me, what are the benefits of doing a PhD? So candidates who are thinking to go for a PhD program must check all the benefits before they jump into this. First is become your own boss. You can choose your research topic and determine the direction you take with it. Then it is up to you to decide when to present your research at conferences and ready for publication. You can also set your own work hours, whether it's 9 a.m. or 5 p.m. or spend whole nights. It's totally upon you. Second thing is experience your interests. Why get a PhD if your, sub if your subject is not for you? PhDs are often exciting projects that help you to explore a field that you find fascinating. And at the end of three or four years, you will be an expert in your particular area. Next thing is chance to become assistant professor in top universities. If you dream of becoming a professor, you can make your dream come true by applying to one of the best universities approved by UGC for the position of assistant professor after qualifying for the CSI net. It is one of the most respectable jobs and you can teach students of professionals depending on your position and skills. The average monthly salary um, of an assistant professor ranges from 25,000 to 40,000 and definitely it increases with your promotion to even higher levels. One more point is you can increase the weightage on your curriculum vitae or resume. After qualifying for CSI and NET, whether, wherever you go to find any job or a PhD program or any other research work, it will impress the interviewer. They will not face any difficulty in selecting you as the perfect choice for that work. This will add milestones to your CV and you will be getting more callbacks also and even more process uh, preference during the interview process itself. Going to the sixth point. Entry in foreign labs for PhD or postdoctorate. Qualifying for the CSI and NET exam opens up the doors for you to get easy entry in foreign labs of PhD or research applications. CSI and NET exam is one of the prestigious exams in India and cracking it is really very tough. 
You can also avail scholarships in foreign universities for your PhD program or even post doctorates once you apply for the same. Next point is opportunities to get a job in public sector units. If you don't like being a teacher, if you you have another chance to work for higher paying government organizations, various PSU companies often recruit qualified CSI net candidates for various departments such as R&D, research development, human resources, HR, finance, etc. After qualifying this exam with a good score, it is also an advantage as PSUs now have direct access to your net scores and select qualified candidates based on their academic profile. The minimum salary in PSUs varies from 40,000 to even 70,000 and definitely it increases with your promotion. There are also high chances of promotion in your existing job or research project. Many candidates prepare for the CSI net exam while doing job itself or research work for better career opportunities or to avail scholarship. When you qualify this exam while doing your job, it will become under your manager's vision also and there will be a higher chance that you might get promoted in your existing level. Not only will the proportion you will get, but you will also get respect from your colleagues which matters even more than money. Next is you can you get the opportunity to become author or even publish a book. If writing interests you, you can become an author and write on topics that you love. You can even publish books on different topics. With experience, you may also have the opportunity to publish your writings in magazines. Additionally, you can also do content writing work for various organizations looking for someone like you. Several people find writing as their career option and they do well in that. Reading and writing are two very different aspects. Last but not the least, you will get respect in friends and relatives. It is a human tendency that seeks respect from others. Every student thinks that about this at some point during their preparation journey. After qualifying this exam, the respect will automatically increase in your friend circle, relatives, and they will start giving respect. This is one of the most desired thing for CSI net aspirants. There, you have 10 big reasons why you should really work hard for this exam and take a step to make your future career bright. Thank you everyone for listening and your time and patience.